To create a cool depth scan effect like this in After Effects, begin by creating a new composition titled Depth Scan Effect. Set the preset to HD 1920x1080, the frame rate to 25 frames per second, and the duration to around 30 seconds with a black background. Once your settings are applied, click OK. In the project panel, double click to import your clips, both your PNG and background clip. Drag and drop your background clip onto the timeline first, then place the PNG clip above it. Press S to open the scale properties and resize your PNG accordingly. Next, right click your PNG layer, choose Pre Compose, and name it Mains, making sure Move All Attributes is enabled before clicking OK. In the timeline, right click Select New and choose Solid Layer with a white color. In the Effects and Presets panel, search for the Linear Wipe effect and apply it to the solid layer to introduce a transition effect. With the solid still selected, search for Roughen Edges and add it for Depth and Texture. Right-click the solid layer again, pre-compose it as Reveal, and confirm that all attributes are moved. Set the track mat of the mains comp to reference the reveal comp for a linear wipe effect. Shift select both comp layers, right click, pre compose them as base, and hit OK. Duplicate the base layer and rename the copy to scan. For the scan layer, search for the difference mat effect and drag it on. In Effect Controls, set the Difference layer to Base and change the view to Final Output. Move the Base layer 2-3 to three frames forward to create a glitchy visual. Select the Scan layer again, add the Find Edges effect, followed by the Tritone effect. And adjust as needed. Once you're happy with the preview, search for Deep Glow and apply it to the scan layer. Set the radius to approximately 150% and the exposure to about 0.70 for extra punch. This results in an eye-catching depth scan effect in After Effects. Thanks for following along with this tutorial. If you enjoyed the process or found it helpful, don't forget to share, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned for more creative content, and I'll see you in the next video.